Yo, yo, what's good, people? Salute to all those that are subscribed. So salute to all those who watch Side and Eyes as well. Check this. Jump right into it. Bet on yourself, man. Y'all see the title. Learn to put everything that you do in every which way, shape, or form and put it on you. Again, a lot of us, we find interest. We find hobbies. We into it for a minute. And then next thing you know, we got too many things distracting us. So we never really get a real aspect of devoting time, energy, blood, sweat, and tears, grit and grind into what it is that we doing. Like I said, again, we rather bet on other people instead of betting on ourselves. Anything that's sure, we betting on it because it's a for sure thing. When it's you, you don't bet everything on the house. You know what I'm saying? You don't bet it all on you. Sometimes you got to bet everything on you, the whole house, for you to get to where you got to go. Now, whether that's in business accounting, whether that's in you buying your first home, car, something that's, some things that are beneficial to you in your life. Maybe not such things as materialism, like materialistic things, but something that's going to benefit you in the long run to get you where you need to go and to fulfill whatever need or desire that you have that lies on your heart or your mind. And we got to learn to do that more often. We work nine to five, you know, we work our eight hour, 12 hour, 10 hour, 16 hour shifts. And then we ain't got nothing left in the tank for us. For yourself, rather, I should say. We not reading more. You know what I'm saying? We not learning what we need to learn, whether it's even in stocks and bonds. Or, I don't know, being an electrician, being a carpenter, being a plumber. Putting, being a chef. Putting all our eggs in a basket and taking off with it. Even though we learn not to put all our eggs in one basket, but sometimes you got to bet on yourself when you know you can do it. When you know you want the time and need when you know that there is no handouts in this life you may get one here and there few and far in between but you gotta bet on yourself you gotta put forth you gotta lay, lay the groundwork get a plan execute the plan don't let no distraction or, 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 or distractions that are uh, that can be placed aside easily Put that aside. Go after what it is you say you want. Stop talking about it. You all got to stop talking about it. Now, we talk about it a little bit just to, to vent and, and to be happy about what it is that we thought of that's a great move for us. Whatever that is for you, yours will be different from mine and, and, and from other people's. But you got to remember that. What is it going to take? One. When can this possibly happen? What it is that I'm trying to do that's going to benefit me or the people around me or the community. How I'm going to get this done and how long it's going to take. What's the projected uh, uh, estimated time that you can get this done within a reasonable and a, 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 a manner. You know what I'm saying? As long as it's reality. You know what I'm saying? Because we operate out of reality and out of fact. When you're maturing in this life, you know what I'm saying? When you're trying to self-improve yourself. Never escape reality. You know what I'm saying? About what you what you can do. You know what I'm saying? Even if you look at people like Jeff Bezos, from uh, for those who do know, from Amazon. Everything wasn't just thought of in one day. And just because his plans got knocked down, don't mean he don't start again. He don't keep going, he don't keep pushing his agenda about what it is that he wants. He wants to eliminate pretty much the mail service and be the mail service like getting you your product within a day or two you know what i'm saying that wasn't just something that came about right then and there he had to fail at it a couple times he kept pushing his agenda about what he wanted he bet on himself many many years of failure many many years of people telling him you crazy and this is not gonna work 
Look at all those people that we see on TV and we think that's a, a hope and a dream for us to be the same way. And I'm not talking about always necessarily riches. You got to, yo, you have to put your mind outside of materialistic shit. It's not going to help you always. If, the, if your eye is, is, is consistently on what, what can take you, then you're going to have a problem. And what it is that you do. Now, again, we get around a group of people, we get around the masses of people, and we always try to figure some things out. Don't always be the smartest person in the world. Surround yourself with smarter people or smart people in general. That's how you get your weight up, your IQ up in life. You know what I'm saying? So you can end up betting on yourself. Whether you want to do a podcast, whether you want to sell sneakers, whether you want to build, I mean, excuse me, breed dogs, whether you want to drive trucks. All that's got to come from you. All that's got to come from self-determination. All that's got to come from any and everything that you have dreams and desires about and to manifest them into something bigger and better for yourself. But if you don't better yourself, you'll never get nowhere. You'll, all, you'll stand on a curb watching everybody else get theirs, hunt for theirs. Now, if you want to be a person that only talk from the sideline and actually participating and playing in this game we call life, then you will be passed by every single time. There is no bus to pick you up for your purpose or your desire for you to all bet it on you. There is none. And the faster you get that, the faster you will be to put something together, a plan of action to get to where it is you got to go. But if you don't bet on yourself, even through the failure, even through the hard time, rough nights, long nights, no sleep, sleepless nights, It'll all be worth it. But if you but if you stop short and fall short and just stop right there because you got a couple roadblocks, you're gonna continue to stay on the sideline and watch other people. But it's okay to stand on the sideline if you're gathering up information, if you're observing what it is that people that come before you that's doing it, and how could you do it better? Now, if you're observing and collecting information, then cool. Sometimes we gotta be on that curve. Sometimes we gotta watch the game from afar. And watch how people operate and maneuver. So we can make this, so we can make different choices. And if it happens to be a mistake, and how we lean, lean on our knowledge about the things that we want to do, that's fine. It's a part of that process. It's a part of the process. This all goes in on betting on yourself. But I'm telling you, there's gonna be mistakes made. You have to make mistakes in order to be better. If you don't make no mistakes and get to the top, you're fortunate. You're one of the lucky ones. You're an anomaly. But that doesn't happen for everybody. But if it happens to happen to you, then fine. You got it all. You figured it out for yourself. But if you don't, then you stop at the sign of first weakness or first failure about your plans of executing to, to bet, on, bet it all on yourself. That's where you gonna stay. That's where you gonna stay. So learn to bet it, bet it all on yourself. It's not always gonna happen. Every plan of action doesn't come together as all plan. You just keep going until you find it is that that fulfills you. Whatever that you find that fulfills you for your purpose. Whatever you feel that's your destiny, just bet on yourself. Bet it all on you. It's okay to help other people and bet on them. But when you bet on them, you give them direction. So you need people like that in your corner to give you direction when it's time to bet on yourself. Now that's fine. You got to get that direction. But if you don't get it, you're going to find yourself very distracted about the support you lack. About your thoughts in doing certain things and progressing you will stop so surround yourself with people that was willing to support you to 
that's willing to bet on you this time versus you betting on them as a short thing. Bet on a, bet, bet it all on you as a for sure thing to anything else in this world, anything else in this life. You gotta bet on you. So that's my time, people. I just want to get out of that. It's a little longer than I thought it would be, but I go. I, I'm really, I really live by this. Somebody need to hear this. Somebody needs to hear this. That's all. So y'all be blessed, people. And I'm gonna keep it pushing until the next one. All right.